A school bus crashed southeast of Lincoln this morning and nearly a dozen people were taken to the hospital. Authorities say there were nine kids on the bus who all had minor injuries. Channel 8's Matthew Mitleider was at the scene this morning. The Nebraska State Patrol is investigating after a school bus got into a rollover crash southeast of Lincoln on Tuesday morning. At about 730, the bus was headed down Highway 2 on its way to drop off students in Palmyra and Bennett. The state patrol says the bus slowed down to pull into a driveway when a pickup failed to brake and hit the bus from behind, flipping it around and tipping it over. Nine students between the ages of 5 and 14 were taken to a hospital in Lincoln. The bus driver and the pickup driver were also taken to the hospital, but officials say none of the injuries appeared to be life-threatening. Thank goodness uh, none of those injuries were uh, more serious than they were. It could have been a lot worse than it was. Uh, it's, 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 a, it's a superintendent's nightmare. Uh, it's all of our nightmare to have our children hurt in any way. The children were reunited with their parents at the hospital. The superintendent says he's grateful for the first responders who helped at the scene, as well as the bus driver who was able to get students out of the situation safely. Everybody that was on site, uh, one of the things they commented on was the professionalism, the efficiency, and uh, just the, um, uh, the care for our kids that our uh, bus driver had this morning, helping get the kids off, uh, counting the kids, making sure they were okay. As everyone moves forward, he says the district will be providing crisis counseling for any students affected by the crash. You never know what the psychological impact is, uh, even if the physical injuries may not be um, as serious as you think, you never know. Maybe kids are uh, might be afraid to get on the bus. Uh, maybe there's kids that were impacted because their friend might have been on the bus. After the crash, traffic was restricted on Highway 2 for several hours until the bus was flipped over with a crane truck and towed away. Authorities have not yet said whether the driver of the pickup will be cited. The investigation is ongoing. Reporting in Lincoln, Matthew Mitleider, Channel 8 News. And as the kids recover, nearby community members are talking about the crash, why it happened, and how another could be prevented. Channel 8's Veronica Bretto listened to a group of bus drivers who held an emergency meeting after the crash. She joins us live with their thoughts. Veronica? That's right, Megan and Rod. I'm right here out in Palmyra. This is the place where the crash happened earlier this morning. And since it happened, we've been speaking to the community. We spoke earlier with the owner of a house really close to this space, to this place, who says he saw the entire thing happening. He says he saw the bus driver helping kids out of the bus on what he calls a heroic action. I also spoke to a former school bus driver who says people speed down Highway 2 without regard for school buses. I also spoke to the superintendent who he was heading to the meeting, to the bus driver's meeting, and he said, in fact, yes, it is a concern, people driving too fast in this area. Now what the community wants is to remind people to be aware of their surroundings, to pay more attention, especially when there are children and school buses around. Reporting live from Palmyra, Veronica Barreto, Channel 8 News. All right, Veronica, and again, the good news with all of this, no major or life-threatening right. injuries. So thank you for the live report.